Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy. Today we're going to check out the Mole Rat Generator Suite. And 900 atoms, but you do get different levels of generators. You get like the small, the medium, the large, and the fusion variant. So, it seems kind of cool. I mean, they've got little mole rats running around inside of them. But uh, really... To determine if it's going to be worth 900, I think we we got to hop in and actually see them in action. All right, so here we are with our small generator. I, I kind of dig that it's it's on like a little pallet. That's pretty darn cool. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I kind of wish I could have the little pallet. Can I? Is that too much to ask for? Some pallets? I would love to have some pallets. But that is freaking cool. It's like a little baby mole rat running around in there. That is... That's pretty darn cool. I'll give them that. But... What does it look like when we blow it up? That, that seems to be something I keep forgetting to do when it comes to showing things off. So I'm trying to rectify that. We're going to be blowing them all up. So, nothing super fancy here. Let's move on. To the medium. Kind of just like a souped up version of the small one. So this time around we'll get two little mole rats running around. Uh, a little bit larger of a pallet. But yeah, about as expected. It's kind of cool watching them run around in there though. Uh, Alright, I don't know if anybody else caught it, but it looks like... The back mole rat disappeared there for a second. I, I don't know. Kind of caught me off guard. So to teach it a lesson, we're going to blow it up. Because why not? And, yep, that was uh, not spectacular. And the base of it is tiny when it's blown up. It's like the same size as the small one. But alright, let's get on to the, the large generator. I mean, this thing's pretty darn big. It's almost the size of a, a freaking fusion generator. Alright, so we got three mole rats this time around. It is so cool, though, getting to watch them run around in there. I, I don't know. I mean, it's a brilliant idea. And I hate mole rats, so, you know, finally getting some use out of them would be nice. All right, let's let's blow this one up and see if uh, anything special comes of it. Kind of doubting it. And all right, nothing nothing to write home about. Let's move on to the fusion generator. I've got so many broken pieces around here. I gotta find the right spot to put it. Okay, so they'll be running around inside the end of it. I mean, this thing's freaking huge. But it doesn't look half bad. I'll give it that. Let's find the right spot to put it down. There we go. Oh, now that looks freaking cool. Yep, yep. I, I definitely dig this one. I love the little screen over here that there's actually stuff going on. Even though it's happening really freaking quick. I mean... Yeah. Uh, I totally dig this generator. I mean, that is a really cool look to it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm sold. The, hands down, I think this is now my favorite generator. I love the little guy that falls behind and then rolls down on the inside. That is so... That That's a nice little added touch. Yep, yep. So, let's blow it up. I almost feel bad about it, but we're gonna do it. Alright, for science. Um, oh, okay. So when you blow it up, the base of it seems to face the opposite way that it, it's actually placed. That's, uh, that's kind of weird. Yeah, okay. 
So that seems to be the biggest downside to this item. Uh, whoop de doo I mean, the little guy rolling down. I, I think that, that completely makes up for it. <laughs> I like that. So, I'm kind of thinking, you know, maybe you hide most of the generator behind a wall. And you have just that section sticking through. That might, that might look kind of cool. I don't know, I have to fiddle around with this a little bit, but there... I don't, it's got potential. So is it worth buying? Um, for me, it was. For you, maybe you want to wait till it's on sale. I don't know. Hope you've enjoyed it. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later.